Well, the, the main and, and um, obvious reason to me is that whenever I see something that happens um, that I believe is not right, I feel it's my duty, um, just as a citizen, um, to call it out. And so that's the least I can do. But what I've decided to do, I've taken a large risk and I've taken the judges to court. And we've gone through um, a couple levels of the court system and have not received um, the type of opinion that um, I believe would be to be legally accurate. And so therefore, at this time, we must go to the highest court in the state of Illinois, and that's the, the Supreme Court. Um, at the Supreme Court, I expect them to fairly um, look at the issue of retention, which retention is required for judges that have been elected. It's a simple process that's been followed by every other judge in the state. And the reasoning behind um, the three St. Clair County judges deciding that they should um, not be seeking retention and rather that they are seeking election is because they do not believe that they can receive 60% of the vote. Um, the chief judge, John Barasivic, has stated that he thinks the voters should get the chance to decide and that they should not get kicked off the ballot. I firmly disagree. The voters deserved a chance to vote for them um, on their, based on their retention, um, as the Illinois Constitution um, permits them to. The other question on the table is the word may. The word may um, obviously is in the Constitution because you cannot force a judge to continue serving if they wish not to. They may seek retention or they may resign. You know, you cannot force somebody to be an indentured servant for the rest of their life. Um, the voters deserve the chance to decide whether or not to retain those three judges. They are not getting that chance. It's not fair.